Hello, ladies, gents, and ambitious hustlers with their nose to the grindstone. Here's me. Nose to the grindstone. Getting more attempts. There's been some real promising ones. I thought that we may have had it in the previous one. I could have totally made it if it weren't for those damn meddlesome kids. Could have been. Could have. Got run away with it. Murder, murder all these damn bats. I do have some reservations about my performance today because literally all morning has been finishing Elden Ring. Was the ordeal. Uh, the backlog is a little built up, so you won't see it for a while, but it's over. It's over. It was so upsetting. Oh, it was so upsetting. Holy crap. I've been waxing poetic. I've been... Full of hubris, saying, Psh, all these big fat whiners saying the DLC is so hard. They are just big man babies. What a pile of trash video gamers had not yet reached the final boss. Holy crap, that was the worst and also the best. It is, you know, a mixed feelings situation. Anyway, I don't want to get too hard into that. Or, that's triggered. Oh, yeah, okay, good stuff. Piece of trash wanted to kill me. Mm, I have been posting two videos for the whole month, with the exception of the weekends. That's why sometimes, sometimes you don't see it because it's the weekend. Either way, like I've been doing two videos on weekdays, only one during the weekend. And I was like, I want to see. I want to do an empirical test. I don't care about extrapolation of what I feel is true. I want the actual stats. There you go. And the test is pretty much complete. And also not just the stats. I didn't do it to see, oh, how much money can I get if I do this? Although it was part of the motivation. Not gonna fib to you fellas, to you distinguished denizens of the internet. But for the most part, it was figuring out, can I do it and not burn out? Way, way back. I did that for a little while with The Binding of Isaac. I would play The Binding of Isaac plus whatever else. And I would post two videos every day as well. That happened, I oh, don't know, man, six years ago already. So it's been a while. Uh, I think two bombs will have to do here because I don't think there's access to this Ujarai cave. cave. We have to actually go around them. Plus the third. And the fourth. If you want to not use a rope, which I do not want to use. So that is the expenditure that I had to do. And my verdict. After one month of doing it. Is saying eh, it really is not worth the hassle. But for reasons that you may not anticipate, what truly pushes me over the edge is the thumbnails. The, and the filling out the descriptions and, and uh, all the little management that needs to happen with the YouTube. You know, all the ancillary crap around it. Producing the content is actually the most enjoyable part. And I do like making thumbnails, but when I have to do two a day, it eats up an inordinate amount of time. It just, it's just silly. And particularly, not even, like this may be surprising, particularly the ones that I was AI generating, because while, sure, I am not drawing that shit, it's still really time consuming to find a proper prompt and go through iterations that are remotely good. How about you do a rolling, Mr. Mole Man, you piece of garbage, I hate you. I am so full of hatred for all video games right now. Son of a bitch. You piece of garbage. You absolute trash. Are you dead? You're not dead. I hate everything. Get destroyed. Piece of trash. I hate you so much. I just can't get over how much I loathe you. Anyway, 
Uh, it's so time consuming. You just don't get it. You just don't get it. You, you plebeians, you normies out there that don't make content. Uh, son of a... <laughs> uh, it really is so time consuming. Oh, these poor bastards did. Feels good, baby. Let's get through here. And even the ones like in this particular daily challenge, the thumbnail always going to be is will be some updated text. That even that still takes time to accomplish. I will put in about 15 minutes from start to end uh, to change the date, which I have been drawing by hand, then edit the text. Export the save, eh, maybe over like 10 minutes. For, for this particular thumbnail, 10 minutes sounds about right. But spend 10 minutes twice a day all week. And then you're starting to talk about some real time. And the thing is, these are the easy ones. These are the ones that barely take any time. Normally, if I had to do any work whatsoever, you're talking about 30 minutes to an hour per thumbnail. Even if it's not good. It's just... It's crazy. It, it do be crazy, though. Oh, well, this guy can actually get up there. Let me uh, rope my way over here. And he should eventually roast himself. Well, I have made a mistake. What a, what a nightmare. <laughs> this is just awful. I hate everything about this level. It's just absolute trash. Why is he not coming up here? Please, now I need you to climb this rope. Perfect, well done. Idiot! <laughs> I really wanted to spend a little more time in this level, but it's just too hard. I wanted to rescue Van Horseface. It's too freaking hard. So that's the main source of burnout, believe it or not. It is not actually making the videos, which is the absolute most fun part. It is the fact that I have to basically spend upwards of an hour and a half per day to get these videos ready for publishing it's a tragedy i say and you could say well idiot dumbass idiotic trash gobbler you may have all these terrible epithets for me and i wouldn't blame you please i want i want a bow i need a bow surely it will be somewhere down here are you it? Yeah, I, I don't appreciate the fact that it requires yet another bomb because I did not do this right. Might as well get myself a little bit of cash. Huh. I want this ruby. I want it. Uh, it too was surprising for me. And you could say, well, maybe it don't work so hard at the thumbnails. Put black text on white background, but put black tits on white background is are they really that important i don't know this is sen a big sense of pride and accomplishment to quote activision was it activision to quote one of them awful corporate messages about microtransactions and achievements uh -huh. okay i would like to rescue this cat I have some patience here with this rock dog Mm. sense of pride and accomplishment I'm putting on a decent thumbnail you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying so that is the thing that just be, has been kind of weighing on my conscience it's pretty upsetting and you could say well you you fool get yourself an editor problem solved get yourself somebody that will do that for you uh excuse me uh, I didn't realize I was talking to the Prince of Zimbabwe with big fat money bags in their pockets. Like, uh, what, how much do you think YouTubing for a middling, tiny Spelunky, mostly Spelunky channel brings? It ain't thousands of dollars, I'll tell you that much. So, <laughs> if this person wants to work for three peanuts on a half-eaten sandwich... I mean, I won't stop you from uh, from volunteering, but uh, seems delusional to expect anybody to work for maybe 10 hours a week. So, not going to happen. 
So that's the reason why probably we're going to be going back to the one video a day schedule. I'm just waiting, you know, chilling. I'm chilling, waiting out any kind of horrible fire that can destroy me. Do it! Woo-wee! All right. That is not the way I want to go. This way. No, that is the way. I didn't realize. What the, what the hell kind of pro is this? For shame, brother. Die. Okay, this guy is a problem. Let's stop. Make him stop being a problem. Please. Please face away from me! I'm full of hatred. <laughs> You're painting ass. You piece of crap. You half-bred imbecile. Brother. How can he always be patrol? Finally, holy crap. This was silly as hell. Get me through. Please, I need some way of double jumping. And you have it. I will partake of it. Leave you bereft forever. You shan't ever again enjoy the power of flight. Oh, yeah. It's only the beginning of my incredible drip. I mean, that cash. I mean, it's not really necessary for anything, but I'm gonna take it anyway. We like you're going to get super arrowed and then also molest me. How can that possibly take all of my health? It is so insane, man. This is a complaint that everybody had when Spelunky 2 begun. How you can get stun locked. Like, the last point of damage was definitely mine. The other three were so gratuitously idiotic. <laughs> and I am not cutting off the video immediately. I'm going to stay on rant about how awful it is to get stun locked by three points of damage when you make the tiniest non-mistake, such as anticipating that one block of a vampire falling is going to stun you to death. 